Meghan Markle and the Duchess of Cambridge have been rumored to be embroiled in a feud since the Hollywood actress joined the royal family in May, with royal expert Kate Lynch suggesting high tensions caused the row between the two duchesses. Rumors of a feud between Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, and Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, have been increasingly surrounding the sisters-in-law over the past few months. Several unconfirmed claims have suggested Meghan Markle triggered the road during a tense exchange before her wedding to Prince Harry at St George's Chapel in Windsor in May. Royal expert Kelly Lynch insisted there is no feud between the two royals but just tension caused by trying times. Speaking to I-24 News, Ms Lynch said, I don't think there's any feud. I think there's probably tension here and there. You have to understand there are rumors that Meghan allegedly made Kate cry during Charlotte's bridesmaid fitting back in May. Kate had just given birth so she might have been a little emotional. My sister has two kids, I know what it's like as an aunt. Meghan was also a bride-to-be so her nerves were probably shot. The origin of rumors about the royal feud is unclear but they coincided with the news that Harry and Meghan were planning to move house. Meghan and Harry are currently shacked up in Nottingham Cottage in the ground of Kensington Palace. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are neighbours to Kate and husband Prince William. Ms Lynch continued, instead of putting these women against each other when they are in really trying times, it was crunch time, it was just before the royal wedding, and tensions are high. This is not to say that they don't get along. They could very well get along. Royal commentator Robert Jobson argued the separation of the two households was inevitable because of the prominent role Prince William will play once he inherits the title of Prince of Wales. Mr. Jobson said, ultimately, it's inevitable that both the household of William and the household of Harry Separton became their own individual households because in time the Prince of Wales will be Prince William. When he is Prince of Wales. He won't be moving out of Kensington Palace. Kensington Palace will be the residence and the office of the Prince of Wales. Earlier this week it was revealed Meghan and Prince Harry have declined an offer to stay at Kate and William's country pile over Christmas. A royal source told The Sun, there's not a huge amount of room at Sandringham so it's quite surprising. Maybe they just want their own space. Things are civil between the couples but they don't spend much time together. The Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton feud rumors may be prompted by Meghan trying to be Diana and other royal experts suggested. Tom Bauer, an unauthorized biographer of Prince Charles, said, The problem is in my view that she is trying to be Diana. She's trying to adopt a new role, and the tragedy of the story is it'll end in the same way unless someone steps in from the palace and says look this is the way it's done here. Royal insider Claudia Joseph said. The reality is that Kate is a very different person. She's very quiet, she's not trying to change the royal family, she's not trying to do anything differently, she's like William. She doesn't like the publicity, she doesn't like to be in the public eye. She has been in the press, there have been lots of stories about her over time. Not so quickly perhaps, but she's not breaking the rules in the same way as Meghan. Amidst the rumors. Kensington Palace announced Meghan Kate and will spend the holiday together with their husbands, Prince Harry, 34, and Prince William, 36. The royal women will spend Christmas at Sandringham as is royal tradition. Kensington Palace confirmed the couples would be spending the day at the royal estate but could not confirm where they would spend the remainder of the festive period.